control people? We have no defense against them. It is true. The guards' workings project elements of the worst kind of that magic. They bolstered guards along the ridge. We've got the high ground. The number of wisps that find you in the lighthouse is unnerving. <sighs> Spite agrees. The three of us on the same page. Well, isn't that something? If by something, you mean also unnerving. Come on, Ilario will meet us at Cafe Pietra. It's not that far from here. We have time for he arrives. I wouldn't mind looking around a while. The markets are running. Good. I need to get some things while we're here. Treviso. I barely had time to look around when we returned from the ossuary. This place, does it feel very different? In some ways, more than I expected. But then, perhaps it's me. Ah, here. Listen to your body. What does it say it needs? A potted plant? For Harding's garden. Spearmint is supposed to calm bad dreams. It's good in desserts, too. So, you and Ilario are cousins? Yes, but we're more like brothers. Katarina took us both in a long time ago now. Here's the place. Bellara mentioned the daily seafood recipe she wants to make. The demon of Virantium is grocery shopping for the team? Have you seen what they eat? It's a miracle you didn't all starve before you hired me. When we met, it didn't seem like Ilario and Katarina were close. It was hard to be close to her, even for me. And I was her favorite. A good selection. Fresh fruit. Nev only eats fried fish. You'd think a detective would have discovered scurvy by now. Is that everything on the list? Yes. And Ilario should be here by now. Let's go before he gets himself in trouble. Wellness grows from the inside out.
You can't buy something for everyone but yourself. Here, this is for you. A wyvern tooth dagger? I loved wyverns as a boy. Katarina would never let me have one of these, though. If the butcher cares so much for Treviso, he'll make sure we have the proper ingredients for this risotto. Welcome. Mariana and I run the best fruit stand in Treviso. Cafe Pietra is just ahead. That's where we're meeting your cousin? Why not the casino? House Cantori has many talents. Making coffee is not one of them. Finally! I thought you might leave me here all by my lonesome. Please, you think I'd ever pass up Café Pietra's coffee? You see, Rook, my cousin is all stomach and no heart. Don't mind him. Ilario cannot appreciate anything but himself. They serve a specialty roast here, Andural's breath. Bitter and sweet, like a kiss goodbye. You should try it. You just described my dream cup of coffee. <laughs> so is there a reason we're not talking about Alario's information or what? We're still being spied on. No, the last one just left. Couldn't take your coffee talk. So, you have something? The crows I sent after Sarah have picked up her trail. They say she's gone to Varantium. I have a friend who's very good at finding people. Katarina was first talent. This is crow business. We can handle it. Apparently not. Your lead is no good, cousin. You have better information? We're compromised. There's no other way Zara could even touch Katarina. You need your eyes here, in Antiva. Zara would never be foolish enough to stay. Not with you out for blood. Of course she would. If the crows protecting her are here... Rook, reason with him, would you? He's been paranoid. I am not paranoid. She came after me. She came after Katerina. She will come for you too. If it'll make you feel better, I'll clean house, all right? Leave it to me. He's gone. Of course he is. Ilario always caves under pressure. Zara's not going to get Ilario, and she's not getting away with anything she's done. I promise. Don't promise. But thank you. Bitter and sweet, you called that blend. Like a kiss goodbye. So, what would a first kiss be? Honey and lavender cream. Sweet. Intriguing. And you? How would you describe it? Every kiss is different. Sometimes a unique pleasure should be just that. 
That sounds like the voice of experience. I've always thought that to live truly is to live fully. But even before I was captured, my life was not really my own. So much had been determined for me. Life's too short to be defined by other people. If I'd had that advice sooner... Once I defined myself as the woman I wanted to be, I was free to pursue what really mattered to me. What really matters to me? Hmm... Perhaps it's closer than I thought. How's your coffee? Dark, complex, and intriguing. Ready to head back to the lighthouse? Almost. <laughs>